can be welcome news for a lot of communities. Newer, brighter lights like these, they're now getting put in neighborhoods all across Tampa. And city leaders say this is going to make your neighborhood much safer. ABC Action News reporter Lauren Mazella is live now with a timeline on when you can expect to see these in your neighborhood. Good morning, Lauren. James and Dia, good morning. So we are out here in Tampa Heights, one of the first neighborhoods that are going to be getting these new lights. And I just want to show you guys the incredible difference between the two. So what you're looking at right here is one of the older yellow lights. Um, then look right over there. They already have some of the new ones installed. Look at how much brighter that is. So soon all of those yellow lights will be obsolete. So Tico says not only are the new lights brighter and more energy efficient, but they project a more powerful light beam. So the idea is to make neighborhoods safer by lighting them up. Residents in Tampa Heights and Ybor City have been telling us how they feel unsafe because of the lack of good street lights, and they say it's making it easier for criminals. Drug activity, prostitution, people are out here desperate. Someone was just mugged, you know, on the sidewalk right here. By lighting up dark streets, city leaders say these new bulbs will shine a light on places where criminals could hide out, and they say it also helps light up dark intersections, making pedestrians more visible to cars. And I'm back out here live. If you do feel like your street just simply cannot wait for these new lights, Tico does say that it is possible for them to accommodate you, but what you will have to do is sign a 10 year service agreement with them. So we have all of the steps that you need to take if you'd like to get your street upgraded to a priority on abcactionnews.com slash GMTV for Good Morning Tampa Bay. Reporting live in Tampa this morning, Lauren Rosella, ABC Action News.